Now here's the dumb question. What do I do? Because it's not giving me anything else other than Stygian and Melted Remnant. Which I like Melted Remnant. But it kind of needs to give me something more to work with. Do I just trust in RNG Jesus? Because RNG Jesus has been failing me. Give me something else, will you, game? If it isn't... I'm probably just going to play extremely reckless and just suicide the run, because finally, something different. You know what? You heard me. I like Melted Remnant. And Sacred Wix is actually not bad. You've actually given me, like, multiple extremely good cards. And the Great Traitor is the Spell Devourer. I shouldn't need the Vapor Funnel. Give me a Traitor's Quill. Who am I? Burn Bright. Rector Flicker. Burn Bright, I always contend, is just the best one you can use here. Unless you can get a really good bomb build going with what you get, like, immediately. Because Sacred... but Sacred Wix is not a way to revive, and we have no way to extend him. We'll give it a shot. Problem is, is our units will be contesting him. Oh, good god. Oh, no. Okay, well, we just can't play Rector. All right. We're gonna do this. I'm gonna use Entumbral Assault, I guess, just as... suicide thing? Maybe? I don't know. I really don't know how I'm going to handle this. Eaten does it enhance it for the duration of the battle. So if I play Draft. Okay, you both would commit suicide instantly. Which is extremely unfortunate. I mean, I'm not reforming him anyway, and I might as well make the best trained steward the world has ever seen. Brief respite. Oh, oh heck no. You are not killing the trained steward. This train steward in particular will be your god. So saith the brain. The lifesteal one's dying. Well, I'm stupid. I usually am. You're dying next turn, that's fine. You're you're both vacating the mortal coil, so sure. Hmm. Well, uh, I kind of need the Rector to live. Hello? Flicker. There's Flicker. All right, Flicker. We're going to try. Uh, you're not going to die on turn one. Interesting. So we're killing you. Okay, yeah, we're fine. All right. We're, we're good. We don't have to worry. There's been so much Melting Remnant today. I can't... 
can't, because I can't guarantee... Well, I can't guarantee revivals anyway, so I might as well just take good stuff to revive. Because Entombed Explosive is always good, because I'm always gunning for it, but I can't guarantee I actually get what I need, so yeah, let's just skip. I do like Mind Collapse, we already have our stuff, so... eh. Eh, is my response. I think I have to go with spell power here. And so I want to really upgrade a train steward. Which there is technically nothing preventing me from just making a really beefy train steward. It is a build. Is it a good build? Probably not. But it is a build. I really don't know what I want to pick here. Either option's not really great. Uh, I guess I'll go and see what the random unit could be. Brain Boy, it's a trap. Stop picking it. Stop hurting yourself. No, saith the doctor. Oh my god, what am I doing? What is this? <laughs> this is so dumb. Why am I doing this? Why am I making this? Why? It makes no sense. <laughs> okay. I, I, I've lost my mind. It's another one, sure. Let's 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 do it. I don't care anymore. I will learn how to make Wheat Legion of Wax be good. It's really not. Um Okay, so we're gonna start off here, cause Rector Flicker I So by default you actually live. So I need to do this. Oh god, you're huge. Alright. And the Flicker is going to sit here, and he is going to... tank most everything. And we'll just make sure things just don't reach you. Ah. Uh. Why did I build this? And this is the good thing about a tumble assault for those freakish idiots who just decide. Oh, good lord. Alright. More soul miner and this thing. And I can resurrect morsels if I really, really feel like it's necessary. It's not. It never is. You know, give me a shade splitter. I'm already ruining my resurrection pool, so I'm not even going to bother holding on to Sacred Wicks. Alright, unfortunately, Rector dies. All hail the Rector. Um, we can put another... No, we can't put another train steward in front. That That is the entire problem. Just eat it. You sweep too, which is... It's not a problem, just could be better. Why am I only getting these? 
you already... I mean, I, the damage I deal is minuscule and doesn't matter. Here, take these dregs. They're sacrificial lambs anyway. I don't need them in my deck. I'm not even sure what I'm looking for. Okay. There's the Untumbral Assault. Um... Could reduce damage output, but I think I'm just gonna speed up kill, because speed up kill is usually fat, better. And, uh, we'll just let the meme build go. It works, I mean... You create a really big multi-strike unit that just refuses to die, and thank God, finally! Okay, this build is becoming less and less of a meme. Alright, what do we got here? I mean, I could always do this. Do I want to? Yeah. We've got one really good unit. We might as well duplicate it. When they were discussing the... Oh, baby. Let's see. Plus three on a random world... Or random four. Hey, well, an off-topic person... I'm seeing my own stream just fine. I know it's not a great indicator, but yeah, I'd recommend just F5-ing. Maybe seeing if that fixes it. <sighs> Plus three to one floor. If I do that, and then I take the general plus ones twice, because they're too offered. I would gain the ability to have two of those things working on the same floor simultaneously. Alternatively, I could just get Rail Forge's hammer, and then I could start applying morsels to those things. Or I can get the locket and just completely screw myself over. No, I'm not going to. Um, I don't know. Yeah, no, let's actually take History of the World. After all this time frozen, the ice, you leave the man behind, false prophet or not, you have a feeling he's helped more, hell, far more than you know. Constructed explosives. Enter with damage shield. Sweet. So that's the one you've applied it to. Um, I mean, memes aside, you die, and then we already gut punch you for so, so much. And then I can just keep applying stuff to the Legion of Wax. And then Rector Flicker can just murder things on the ground floor. Really? Let's go with basic one here, life steal here. I can't play the other Legion of Wax, but that's fine, because I can do this instead and just feed you the garbage and then get rid of this dreg.
they'll be eaten. We'll just keep stacking life steal. You both burn out. If I just do this, that puts you very close to death. The giraffe will die, but that's okay. Antumbral Assault. Give me two more morsels, which I'll just place here. And you know what? Sure, that works. Alright, we got a semblance of a build working. Basically becomes whatever floor this ends up this buff ends up on. Just apply it there. Okay, look, we all know what's going to happen. Um unexpected. All I can say is, uh, all hail Daedalus, you're going to get wrecked when you get to this guy. Hmm, sure. Sure again? Alrighty then, well, I have no clue what I want to do with these. I wish you would die. I can't do the other Legion of Wax, unfortunately. Unless I could guarantee- Oh, yes I can. So you die off. Put the second Legion of Wax up. Double strike this one down, but instead of just merely double striking, we'll also pull out Rector Flicker, who will sit in the front and will tank like a god. And we don't even get to see the super one go off. It just kills them. Hey, Daedalus. It is kind of a case of stop, stop, he's already dead, but I kind of just feel like it. I feel validated now this thing is actually working. I know this thing's amazing to build around, but by god, I was having such a hard time making it work. No, Formless Child is bad. Formless Child is horrible. Uh, hmm. No, the burnout would screw me over. Remnant Pact. I don't envision these guys dying off in enough for it to matter. No, none of those are good enough. We, we've already got our stuff. Light of Seraph. We need more space on this train. These things are enormous. Um, could upgrade my spells. No, spells are kind of worthless, actually. Unstable Vortex, get rid of Train Steward, and the Steward. I've got to upgrade a unit with Quick. Honestly, a draft with Quick is like a good spell, kind of. And if we just make him good. He'll be uh, good and survivable, and then we'll just uh, delete more train stewards, because train stewards are horrible and I don't want to see them again. Neat. Alright. And Forge Dark Champion. Rector Flicker, no, you're not reforming units. Not with this setup. You, if it was my choice at the end of turn, maybe. Maybe. I don't think...
think six attack really helps them in this situation. All right, who gets the plus three? The top gets the plus three again. Is it permanently the top? Probably not. All right, Rector Flicker will immediately destroy this man with the force of a billion suns, and his son will go in right behind him. Uh, Legion of Wax, numero uno. You'll start getting empowered up here to get ready for the end. Try and reload on mine. It might. I. I don't know what to tell you. Yeah, I'm. I'm very sorry about that. Also, is chat actually showing up? Okay, yeah, chat does show up. Okay, good. It's working fine for me, and it's working fine on what I'm using to watch it as well, so I really don't know what to tell you or how to help you, other than I apologize. I mean, eventually this stuff will end up on YouTube, but we all know how my eventuallys end up. You know what, we can make the tanky one sit down here. And sure, we'll even kill you off. I'm sorry, off topic. Uh, damage shield, health. Oh, baby, the best draft unit I've got. Molded, we will bring back the life eater morsel and drop you off here. And that's all I can do. And they all burn away. I can reform Rector Flicker. That's no problem to me. And that clears the way once again. I can reform two random units. Why do you actually probably, like... I mean, I'm not gonna complain that much. I'm just surprised that it's that common. Uh, you are the worst of these two, so you will be constrained to the fate of being blown up by a tumble assault into another one of yourself. All right. Turn to combat stuff after combat gain five. Well, you're dead, so. And for giggles and grins, let's get our strongest one out there and speed up the kill. Alright, let's see how this goes. The formless spawn win again. They haven't gotten to the other one yet. Hmm. Stealth doesn't seem that great, but I can always take another sacred wix and just use that as unit reformation. 
Ember Forge doesn't seem like a great idea. Crucible Extension, on the other hand. I might actually take Crucible Extension just because my units are so fat and bulky I can't actually fit more onto the train. God. Um, what else do I want? I can't upgrade the Legions of Wax anymore. I can make another one, but that that just goes into excessiveness. Anyway, Shade Splitter, get out of here. One of the dregs, leave, re. Um, concealing Cavern. Oh, not this thing again. I send an enemy unit to the pyre, apply, dazed three. That would never happen. Neither of these are really great. It was random random. So far, out of the six runs I've done so far, Melting Remnant has always been one of them. So I think the randomness is just bugged or my luck is absurd. Or I guess we're just doing Melting Remnant. So our primary clan is Melting Remnant, the allied clan is Umbra. I guess I'll just purge more dregs, because dregs are kind of worthless. I'll toss up a reroll. Large stone. Why not? Why shouldn't I, you know? You go big or go home. Alright. Ah, uh, it's the harvest guy. Well, on the bright side, the, sp uh, the spell shield kind of screws with my stuff, except not really, because I can just kill my own units, so I guess that works. Alright, what do we get? It's the middle this time around. Um... Legion of Wax, Shade Splitter, grab some energy. Rector Flicker seemed like a great idea. On the bottom floor? Yes, because he can murder the tanks. Uh, they're dead. They have been completely removed from my deck. I never want to see them again, and they shall never appear again. Okay, well, this is going to be fun. Um, Draft? Legion of Wax? Wait, how do you... Oh, Tank 1 doesn't die. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, get me an Antumbral Assault to get me some more morsels. And then we can start tossing morsels onto the second guy. Bloody hate the stealth units. Um, you're not dead, but it's also not a huge issue. What do I get? Oh, now you're dead. Well, um, yeah, that was uh, a little unexpected, uh, not gonna lie. Rector Flicker, no! It's not like this happens every single time you exist, Sir Flicker. Hmm. Well, um... I mean, I guess this works. You just build bigger and bigger morsels. You do need lifesteal at some point. And then... <sighs> You have quick and damage shield, so I guess you can just sit here and punch this guy in the face. Oh. 
I could double in Tumbral Assault on you, but that seems like a horrible idea. You know what? Rector Flicker, get in here. Guard this Legion of Wax, will you? And then... We can even give you a damage shield. I don't even know how this is gonna work anymore. Um, I will Crucible Extension on this floor, because I need a little more space. Oh, the oversized tank actually does get to hit me. For one, for like six damage on my actual, he like, pyre. And he's dead. I want to see how this turns out. Let's go. Show me. I mean, there's no doubt that Rector Flicker just doesn't immediately murder hit, like half his health tool by himself. The screams. I want to make the morsels explode, and there is a way to do it. There is a way to make the morsels explode. It's just kind of hard. It's, I know, audio only is uh, terrifying. Perhaps try a different browser, depending on what you got on your phone or whatever your mobile device is, and you might be able to get better results. I'm not sure. Unless this is using the Twitch app, in which case I just, I can't help you. I, I genuinely don't know at that point. Crushing Demise. No, we're not doing Crushing Demise. I might just take a second Crucible extension. No, there's no reason to do a second Crucible extension. There's no reason to grab any of these. Unless I want to put two of the... Um, what is it called? Legions of Wax on the same floor now? I, I really don't need to. Yeah, audio only is a bit risque. The Legions of Wax are a bunch of children all getting murdered brutally, so I guess it's kind of hard to say that. And I know it's like TOS, but it's... Are they actually children? Let's see. I don't know, it's just a bunch of them put together. Never mind. Get me some relics. Uh, let's get rid of one of them. Let's just get rid of the dregs entirely at this point. They are the least useful of the bunch. One of my random trinkets. Morsel units get damage shield one. Whenever I summon my second unit, gain three energy. That's actually really handy. Ah, uh, both of these are great. This prevents sweeps from just killing my morsels, but do I really care about that? No, I want energy. You summon your first morsel, draw one. You know what? Yes. Can I purge another card from the deck? Because I'm going to just start molding them, so... You know what? I don't even need Shade Splitter. This deck is tiny. And even if he devours my spells, my spells really aren't helping, like, anyone. Okay, they're, they're kind of useful, I guess. Alabaster Guardians with Multi-Strike and Empowerment with Rage. Thank you, Fell. Don't we love you all? Alright, Gut Punch the first Guardian. Legion of Wax the second. And we'll start the consumption. That's a lot of rage. You have a lot of pent-up anger. Would you like to dis- Oh my god, I can do it. I can Crucible Extension this floor. 
So if I Crucible Extension this floor, I can put two Legions of Wax on the same floor. No, this isn't actually a good idea. Because I mostly am using it so I can play more Morsels. Um, you know what? We can... Legion of Wax here. And Tumbrel Assault. Uh, you can get the damage shield because you're already taking a ton of damage. We can Crucible Extension on your floor. And Tumbrel Assault here. Grant you a double damage shield because that's actually pretty good. Health. Health. Shade Splitter, health again. That's a lot of anger you're feeling there. Don't you know? Master Yoda says anger leads to hate and suffering. There's something to that effect. Anyway, uh, we are getting our big waxer out to start just murdering the Clit Guardian, so uh, we'll see what happens. Anyway, um, Crucible Extension here, Sacred Wicks, you're dead, Perfecto, Perfection, and the like. That's a card, Drago over here, molded on this point, get another damage shield morsel, bring it out, summon to this point, and we will... Oh, right, quick. Right. Quick. Well. I feel a little dumb, but you know what? I am a little dumb. Our souls will be saved. So saith the broken man. Anyway, and tumble assault here because I need more of these. Lifesteal, which draws a crucible extension, which will play immediately. You are not the worst morsel yet. You are now the worst morsel. So we'll tumble assault the worst morsel. That's a lot of damage morsels. You also need some health. Just like a little bit. You know, just something. I still personally want to kill Fell before the final phase. But I also understand that that's a little bit ridiculous for me to try right now. Um, There are ways to save him. For example, Rector Flicker is the best tank in the U.S. of A. Can I, how much can I Crucible Extension? Well, this technically gains me energy, so I might as well do it. This absolutely gains me energy. Anyway, uh, all this in the top because Rector Flicker will end up dying Crucible Extension again on this. So they're now equal, kind of. And Tumbrel Assault on you and a Molded to bring back... I don't know what I want to bring back. Oh, Lifesteal one. Duh. Because we can put a facet of lifesteal on you, damage, and damage, and here we go. And he grows a bigger still. Again, you have a lot of anger issues that you seem to need some help working through. <sighs> Alright, what do I got? Nothing I can easily entumbrel assault, so I can only hope I can draw into something that lets me do it. Uh, let's get the quick burnout two guy and have him go start murdering down here.
I mean, they're both dead. Ah, Relentless. Yes, my old friend. Uh, you're gonna die by burnout, but that's fine. I don't know how burnout works with you. Who gets it? Does burnout happen first? And then the end of combat? After the next round of combat. So you die at the end of combat. I think. Anyway, you're rubbish, so you will get sacrificed to the morsels. And you will be made so superhuman, I don't even know how to begin to describe it. And we will keep extending the Crucible, because I've got nothing better to do with my life. Get me a damage shield. I don't even think Fel is going to make it past the second floor, but I might as well prepare just in case. Hey, Fel. Damage shield morsel, I actually need to have die. Again, I need to have you die because I get more morsels this way. Oh, wait, Fel's dead. Um. Uh, um. Uh, um, you know what? Sure, get another lifesteal morsel. Let's watch this happen. Fell is very, very dead. All right. What do I do next? Wretch, return consumed morsel units to your hand. Like... All of them? Those that were consumed last turn? Just... Fair enough off topic. Well, I'm glad you got it somewhat resolved or figured out that it's just Twitch wigging out for some reason. I mean, it does that. All systems are doing that nowadays, because they keep trying to put out new features without actually fixing some of the older ones. I'm curious. We're at the point where we can experiment, so why not? Uh, do I really want the Light of Seraph? I don't think so. I think I actually want Fel's Remorse. I'll tell you why. Because when I go to fight the big guy at the end, Crucible Extension will not be able to be used. It's kind of sacrificial. Ah, advanced Prototypes is useless, so Jack Stripes are at least kind of helpful. I don't want anything with holdover. Yeah, I mean, I guess I can do it with molded. Molded, there you are. And then give it an ember stone, I guess. And then we'll do a reroll because this is the most likely one to appear and we can upgrade crucible extensions so it can always be cast. And then we'll just have Rector Flicker be unkillable. Do, do regular damage. Alright. Well, I'm probably going to end up grabbing the Forgotten Boons because there's really nothing else. Am I really doing this? Am I really taking the rightmost path at the next junction? Because I the next boss isn't going to matter. I've yet to hit something that can kill one of them, let alone two of them. Do I want to duplicate it? I think I might just duplicate it again. What are we even doing here? Oh, 
Let's see. You got multi-strike, you got tankiness. The Gilded Wings are the only ones that are actually problematic, because I can't actually guarantee that the Gilded Wings die. Otherwise, I would take the 400 coins and then maybe grab two more relics. We're doing it. We've been doing so well, I can lose some life on this. Hopefully. Alright, it's the second. So, Rector Flicker, you'll appear... This happens, and I genuinely wish I could deal damage to you and kill you with this, but it's just not happening. Alright. Tumble. Oh, that doesn't even kill you. Right, it never does anymore. Um... That works. All right, so what are we doing? We are giving you life, not life steal. Yes, we are giving you life steal. We're also giving you a magma morsel. You're going to live, and that's unfortunate. But fine, I can deal with it. Legion of Wax is always being summoned. Um, we'll give you one batch of life steal and then restore you. Yeah, we're fine. Okay, so Sacred Wix always goes down. Crucible extensioning on this floor, I guess. You're not dying no matter what we do, unless I draw into an Antumbral Assault back here. Lifesteal one can go up here. We did draw the Antumbral Assault, which kills you off, which is perfect. I cannot kill you, except I can. Because... We can pull up this draft again, because Rector Flicker is still alive. Kind of. And we'll give the quick one here. Because even though he's burning out, I want to kill this Gilded Wing before it becomes a problem. And this draft goes up here. Guarantees that you die. And then we're going to start damage boosting the middle one, because it's the easiest one to do. The trash ones will go up top. Your pyre has burned its last. Anyway, sacred wicks, because we can grab anything. We grab the one thing I need. Because we need the quick one. Then we grab molded, so we can pull back Rector Flicker. We can pop over here. Now, how, how does Wretch work? Oh. Okay. All right, I can, I can accept. I don't think I can actually play all these. Alright, um... Wretch has gone up significantly in the rankings in my mind. Uh, don't let anyone tell you otherwise. It even gets the buffed ones back. Could I theoretically make a build where the entire point is not to actually play Morsels to die, but because I can spam out Morsel tokens reform them using reformation cards and basically keep infinitely recycling these with wretch and reformations to create a really no that's dumb that would never work no that's a theoretical that should not be explored if i get rid of you Uh, that guarantees that this one dies, which is fine, and the damage shield one literally cannot be played. Um, sweet. Alright, 
All right, we're tossing up a Crucible extension here because I literally can't play all the Morsel cards. And I'm gonna cry because I'm gonna retch and uh... Hey guys! All right, well, uh, you're back. And uh, oh my god, <laughs> look at that face. You look like my next mistake. Uh, I'm gonna untumble assault you because you dying is fine. I need to dump these off somehow. I'm making too many morsels. I can't get rid of them. They keep coming back. It's actually a lot worse than it sounds. I cannot get rid of these morsels. And so my deck is slowly getting filled up with morsels I can't remove. Brief respite. It's so unfortunate. Well, I can tumble assault you, which is not bad. I want to get rid of you. If I jeweler. Okay, yeah, no, I can't get rid of you. All right, well, that's fine. Uh, just extension and dump morsels. Uh, you're the most useless, so we'll dump you off. Get another one, which is more useful. It's it's fine if you get through, cause well, actually, ugh, no, I can't end you. That's the only thing that makes me mad is I can't get rid of you. Oh my word! All right, well, um, first things first, get this morsel out of here. Second things second, uh, dump our hand. So we're dumping it in a pointless and tumbrel because you're just gonna heal it all up anyway. And shade splitter, shade splitter. Take my energy. Take this. Uh, I was gonna say, oh, if I'm molded, how much do I get from this? It's 40. No. Get me the uh, good draft. The good draft that deals damage. And uh, vomit uncontrollably. And now stack up damage and damage shield. I'm sorry, I forgot that was a thing. Uh, I'll be honest. Um. All right, let's keep going. Now, sadly, my pyre is going to be hit by a fair amount of damage that I really can't avoid. That's okay. Uh, yeah, uh, we're, we're, we're pretty good. Um... Actually, you know what? Let's make it even better. Rector Flicker, come back. Oh god, that's right. You keep all the buffs. Um. Hmm. Oh, we drew the dead weight. All I can say is, uh, delicious. No one has made it past yet. With Flicker tanking, they just have not made it past. Do I have an X cost in my deck? No, I don't. I really should fix that. <sighs> or Fatal Melting. I would love to just have a buttload of energy and just dump it all at once, but that's just not happening. Fatal Melting, because I actually need more spells. Cannibalize for the same reason. 
She allows me to kill off my units if I don't need them anymore. Okay, so we're not deleting more units. Uh, on the contrary, uh, we are going to... I mean, all these spells are going to be gone. There's no ifs, ands, or buts about that. There's no saving them. So we're going to do what any sane human being would and uh, duplicate the Legion of Wax again. Um... Yeah, uh, Unstable Vortex will be on nothing. It is a waste of time. I have a sneaking suspicion I actually screwed up. This will have the minion boost. It will not. Am I really doing this? What the hell, why not? We're building a, an entire thing around Legion. And if I do this right, enemies should never reach the pyre. Reroll. And we'll get the gorge buff as well. Is there literally nothing I can apply? Yeah, all the slots are full. Alright, well, there's nothing I can do with this money. Alright, Seraph the Diligent, let's go. I have to be very careful about the spells I play. So I'm gonna try to make it... Oh, I'm not gonna get any of the good stuff yet. Or right away. Bloody vengeful shards. Um, oh, it's on the first floor. Interesting, I've never had that happen. All right, that'll gut those two. And just play the vengeful shard. I don't wanna play any of these just yet. Regional Wax, and I guess I could play, like, well, the draft at the back. It would clear the way. And we'll play the other Legion of Wax at the top, and we've got everything set up. Okay, well, I can cannibalize, but we're not going to do that just yet. We're going to do a Shade Splitter, which does gut you. Uh, this one at the top will be the anti-this-guy brigade. I've got nothing to reform yet. We need to fix that. And we're going to fix that using you. Now, this looks dumb, but cannibalize allows me to reform this unit anyway. Now, my deck is now full of these morsels, and that seems stupid. And you're right, it kind of is. However, these guys are going to start burning out this turn, so we're going to be able to start making use of these morsels in a moment, and I need them for draw power. Uh, not doing this yet. I will do Sacred Wix. Boom. Which kills you both. Perfect. And this draft will be in front because he can tank. Get rid of the self mutilation and we can Antumbral Assault. And you'll take the damage shield. Oh my lord. Uh, get rid of you. Morsel Miner is fine. I mean, we, we can start bombing, I guess. Alright, I can place another one. Um, you shall get placed, because I need space. Yeah, I mean, I guess we can start the bombing run. Do some startup damage to you, and take the damage buff, sir. And I would love to reform units, but that's just not in the MO currently.
Vengeful Shard. Get out here. That's unfortunate. But while unfortunate, I can deal with it. I actually want to cannibalize. Because I need some Crucible extensions for space purposes. Morsel Miner. Straight damage hike. You'll get this as well. And we will start working on DPSing you all down. Hmm. Painful. Not unexpected. Okay, I know why you all die. Do I want Legion of Wax to die just yet? I have Molded and a Sacred Wick. If I get... If I get a lot of those spells, I can start resurrecting Legions of Wax if I really, really need to. Oh my god. If I just retch... If I retch right now, some really dumb stuff will start happening. Uh, I'm not sure I want to do that, but I will. My hand is full. I wonder why. And thank God that Drax is going to die. All right. So we're going to start off with a Morsel Miner on the top one, most layer. Then start off with a Morsel Miner here. Uh, Morsel Jeweler. Jeweler and Jeweler. And then we will bomb the group once again, and I wish there was a way I could play these morsels. Alright. That's right, this is the dumb one where if you actually kill one of these guys, their damage output actually goes up by a significant degree. Right. Huh. I don't know how to handle this. I'm being totally honest here. Um, let's just make more. That's reasonable, right? Oh my god. Stop. Please. Um, I want to bring back Rector Flicker, but at the cell, I could bring back a Legion of Wax. Such a bad idea. Morsel Miner, you're going to the top level. Uh, you are... I'm not going to Antumbral Assault because I can't actually get rid of my stuff right now. I don't know why I took the one that says Gorge Abilities Trigger twice. That just doesn't work. Anyway. You are gone. You are gone. Sacred Wick gets tossed out. Because I don't care what I get, really. So, Lifesteal will go on the top one. Molded will happen, because now we're going to bring back Rector Flicker repeatedly. Oh, he, wait a minute, he's dead. He doesn't even make it to round two? I also know that we're, I realize right now that this artifact was actually a bit of a mistake on my part, but y you know what? Um, just, yeah. Um, I think we're clipping this one for a highlight reel. Um, I, I could play Rector Flicker, but I kind of just want to see this happen. Ugh, they're gonna die first. I don't want them to though. So we're going to do this. I'll let you kill one. I'll let you kill two. Okay, so you actually do get eaten. Nice. Alright, let's just watch this happen.
The pyre does not relent. We are so goddamn tanky right now that the Seraph literally cannot punch through this. We are all children of the wax. worst part about all this is, is that was the weakest one. All that effort, all that preparation, all of it was worthless. Because in spite of it all, Legion, Legion with large stone, mind you, like we build heavily into Legion, but we built it with a large stone and had it double its extinguish effect. Under other circumstances, that, like, Legion is terrible, normally. But if you get that specific circumstance that early, there's not really a whole lot bosses can do because Legion will just murder them. Okay, uh, are you still on the black screen? And uh, for that one off-topic person, I can actually kind of explain what's going on with the uh, mature stuff. So I actually turned that on because this was during the time where everything on the internet was becoming very PC family friendly and I just wanted to be good on my ability to just swear on my content without a problem. Which, I mean, I guess makes sense. I should be able to turn it off because I think they've relaxed those rules by a long shot. But I literally have the mature content turned on just to cover myself in case I start swearing like a sailor for some reason. Which I usually don't, but I know I do periodically without realize, without really caring about it. But yes, so to further explain, the card that is here, or that is shown here, is Legion of Wax. It has really terrible base stats, normally. It's an 8-8. Eight, eight. Except... We gave upgrades to one Legion of Wax insanely early on that boosted its health by 40 and its attack by 15, and gave it the ability to attack twice. The special effect of Legion of Wax is when it dies, you summon two smaller Wax twins that are 4-4's baseline, except all those fake summoned Waxes gain all the buffs and benefits that were applied to the original Re Legion of Wax. We have another thing that says that on death effects trigger twice, and those originally 4-4s get the exact same card text as Legion of Wax, but they summon two more smaller Waxen things that create two twos that get all the buffs. So we had a bunch of, at their smallest, 1742s that attacked twice, and we doubled those death, like, on death effects. There were so, we clogged the entire train with them, such that not a single boss was able to lay claim that they could have even cleared a single floor because they just didn't die. And we kept buffing them up using morsels. So they just got even more absurd. Winning a run, you've unlocked the gold border versions of those cards. All hail Legion of Wax. Huh. Trigger a unit's extinguish ability without killing it. 
Guess that's how you're supposed to use Legion Wax properly. Mold Braceless. Friendly units gain extinguish applied f armor 5 to the front friendly unit. I mean, I guess. Alright. Well, I mean... That's all well and good, but I'm going to have to call it for now, as it is getting kind of late at night and I'm still trying to get back onto a proper sleep schedule. However, I'm just uh, taking a lovely look at uh, this stupidity right here. Copy Deep Link. Copies a link to your clipboard that you can send to other Monster Train players to easily view this run summary. Uh, I don't think I need to. Generate a challenge. Huh. Maybe I can look at other just run summaries later. But yes, I will bid you all farewell and good night for the time being, for I must retreat into the digital realms, probably of Terraria, as I know some people are going to be waiting for me. And if not, I'm probably going to just do some RuneScape before the night's out. As I am also needing to sleep, because I've got homework I need to do tomorrow morning. So, farewell, and good night.